name is Razorwing from the Silver Tower project and today I'm going to show you how to quickly add UV mapping using a tool called Turbo Unwrap. We assume you have already installed Turbo Unwrap before beginning this tutorial. And we assume you know quite a bit about modeling already so I won't have to explain the basics to you. So to start off let's maximize our viewport and create a normal spline like I'm sure you've done many times before. And we'll go into segment mode and extrude the segments to get a shape like that. And then we're going to add a surface modifier to it. And there we have a normal model. Let's just convert it to an editable mesh. And it'll be like any other model. You can do this technique by various means. For instance, you could have created a plane for this polygon and just extrude it in different ways. There's many ways you can get a model like this. So let's apply a material. I've chosen the texture Shading All Stonewall 02 from Oblivion because it tiles rather well and uh, it suits the purpose of this model which is just meant to look something like a city stonewall. So let's select a few of these segments and drag them to different C heights. Just to make it look a bit more interesting and to highlight the, the way Turbo Unwrap works. So let's add an Unwrap UVW modifier which makes Turbo Wrap kick in. We're going to edit mode. I don't know why these arrows pop up every time I use Turbo Unwrap, but they don't seem to affect how the program works. So we're going to face mode and then click in the viewport and hold on to control and press A to select all the faces. Now go into the Turbo Unwrap um, window and click Mapping, select the Mapping and just leave all the settings at default and click OK. And now you see um, the shape of the model is displayed on top of the texture, I don't know what to call it, the texture template, I guess. And one of the cool things about Turbo Wrap is you can choose to display the texture behind the map. And uh, if you look closely, you see, oh, for instance, uh, this polygon is textured just like on the backdrop here. See? This part corresponds to this part of the texture. Now we want the, the whole texture to tile along with the wall. So let's go into vertex mode. And we're gonna make sure to, how do you say, drag out the template to cover the whole texture. And we do that by selecting the top vertices and then clicking on this box and Enter 1 and hit return. And then select the bottom vertices, enter 0 and hit return. And if you want to be meticulous, you can select the vertices at the end and enter 0 there. And these and enter 1. And then you have a perfect tiling. So let's close this window. And as you can see, it looks extremely stretched out. And that's because the whole model is just tiled once. So this, this is just one continuous texture on the whole model. So let's add an UVW X form modifier. And we can see that we have one, two, three, four, five, six segments. So let's make it tile six times. And there you have the wall. And you see how the texture flows along with the shape of the model goes down and up and down and up and down again. And you could you, you can make this any shape. You see it tiles even in that direction. So it's a perfect UV map. It couldn't be more perfect. Technically perfect that is. So that's what I have to share about Turbo Unwrap and I hope you learned something new from this tutorial. Check us out at silver.com for more information about modeling in general for Oblivion and our own mod team.